السلام علیکم دوستوں کیسے ہیں آپ لوگ ٹھیک ہے میں ہوں جہانگیر میرے ساتھ ہم ساتھ جہاں سے بار عمگیر اور آپ دیکھیں ہمارے چینل پر تو کیسے ہیں آپ سب ٹھیک ہے ہم سب کو مرد پیار السلام آج ایک اور زبردست قسم کی اور انٹرسٹنگ ویڈیو لے کے آئے ہیں یہ ہے جی ففٹین تھنگس یو ڈی نوٹ نو اباؤٹ انڈیا تو اس لیے جی ہمیں دوستوں نے کہا تھا کہ اس کے اوپر آپ ضرور ویڈیو بناو تو یہ ہے جی ایلیکس ڈاٹ کام والوں کی ویڈیو ہے اور یہ بہت زبردست قسم کی ویڈیو بناتے ہیں یہ پوری دنیا ویر فائٹ چینل ہے ان کے چاہے حضور سبسکرائب کریں ہم نے چاہے ڈسکرپشن میں لنک دیا ہوا ہے اور ہم نے چلتے ہیں ویڈیو کے اوپر سبسکرائب اور اس کے بعد یہ ہمیں سب سے پہلے بھی وینم بھائی نے کہا ہے دور سرکار نے کہا ہے دیپک مستری ہیں انہوں نے کہا ہے میرا نام لیں تو کافی دوست ہیں اور اب ہم چلتے ہیں ویڈیو کے اوپر اور دیکھتے ہیں کہ یہ آیا ہمیں کون کون سی انٹرسٹنگ قسم کے فیکٹس ملتے ہیں تو لیٹس سٹارٹ ففٹین تھنگز یو ڈی نو اباؤٹ انڈیا ویلکم ٹو اے لکس ڈاٹ کام دا پلیس ور فیوچر بلینئرس کم ٹو گیٹ انسپائرڈ Hello Aluxers and welcome back to another fascinating video. Today we're looking at an incredible facts you didn't know about the 7th largest country in the world, India. With a population of over a billion people, India is one of the most influential and powerful countries in the world. Its cultural history is particularly complex and detailed, spanning 4,500 years of predominantly Hindu philosophy and theology. Thousands of years later, modern India is profoundly different with its own colossal film industry, a diverse population, and an astonishingly big workforce. Because Alux.com is dedicated to becoming the world's best resource on the most interesting countries and destinations, we couldn't wait to bring you 15 things you didn't know about India. Mm. Number one, mm. Hollywood's mm. highest grossing film made 27 times more than Hollywood's highest grossing film. For That's every sure. 600 films Hollywood produces, Bollywood will make 1,000. They're the most profitable films, too, when you compare the numbers. Hollywood's <laughs> highest grossing film was 2009's Avatar, which made $2.8 billion at the box office. In stark contrast, the Bollywood film Three Idiots brought in $76.81 billion. Now that's a profit. <laughs> Number two. Shampoo was invented in the 16th century, India. Derived from the Sanskrit shampoo, which means massage, the concept of shampooing was invented in India in the 16th century. Herbs and natural ingredients were used then rather than today's combination of modern chemicals and fragrances. In particular, gooseberry, sapindus, and fruit pulp. When colonial visitors came to India, they brought the practice of shampooing and hair washing back with them to Europe. Number three, diamonds, diamonds were diamonds first mined in India, Surat. and it was mm. the world's greatest producer. India was the most productive diamond mining Surat. country in the world until diamonds were found in Brazil in the 18th century. There are now three active diamond mines in India, and the famous Kohinoor diamond was found in the 13th century. Diamond the 793-carat ah. stone went from person to person and was eventually acquired by Queen Victoria during ah. the British Raj in Number four, yes. elephants in Kerala can treat themselves to a spa day. Kerala, the Thorkata Elephant Yard Rejuvenation Center provides elephants with baths, massages, and soothing pamper sessions. The spa caters to 59 clients and is a way of giving back to the sacred animal. Elephants play an important role in Kerala's temple processions and are a significant feature of the region, so they deserve a massage from the man. New era movie wale. Okay. Number five, the largest religious gathering in India can be seen from space. Kumbh Mela is a Hindu pilgrimage which takes people to the banks of the Ganges every time. Kumbh Mela, Kumbh Mela. The picture event involves ritualistic bathing, devotional singing, religious discussion, and feeding the poor. The attendance figures had to be capped at 75 million, making it the largest pilgrimage on earth. Number six. Ancient Indian civilization is the oldest in the world. We often look to ancient Greece and ancient Egypt, but Indian civilization dates back to 2400 BC, when it was split into 16 monarchies known as the Mahajanapadas. There are even authenticated human remains that date back to 30,000 years in South Asia. 
the oldest Hindu texts were written between 2000 and 500 BC, as well as the first texts on science, medicine, and astronomy. We actually owe the number zero to Indian mathematics, who created the concept. Number seven. India is home to every major world religion and doesn't have a national language. Hinduism, Christianity, Buddhism, Islam, and Sikhism all have a place in Indian society, with the most dominant being Hinduism and Islam, covering 80% and 14% of the population, respectively. Judaism has existed in India for the last 2,215 years, and some of these smaller religions also featured, including Jain, Zoroastrian, and Baha'i. India also doesn't have a single national language because 1,652 dialects are spoken across the different regions. Number 8. A polling station is set up for just one voter in Deer Forest at every election. Uh, every so election, Barack Barangos de Chandes gets his <laughs> local polling uh, station entirely to himself because he's the only resident of Deer Forest. He's been voting in Indian elections since 2004, and never misses one now that he has his own personal polling station. Mahant is the caretaker for the one temple in the forest in Gujarat, a home he shares with the rare Asiatic lion. Number 9. The Indian government has used scaffolding to hide the Taj Mahal when airstrikes are predicted. During the Second World War and the Indian-Pakistan Wars, scaffolding was put up around the distinctive domes of the Taj Mahal, to make it less obvious from above. They feared strikes by the Japanese Air Force during World War II, so hid their most famous landmark. More recent threats to the Taj Mahal include the rising levels of the Yamuna River, which has cracked the tomb underneath the structure. There have been predictions that the tombs could collapse at any time. Check out our video, 15 Most Expensive Man-Made Attractions in the World, to find out what ranks along the stunning Taj Mahal. Number 10. Indians invented navigation, yoga, the world's cheapest car, and thorium-based nuclear power. Indian society can take credit for some of the most important inventions in the world. They were the first to create the concept of navigation over 6,000 years ago, using rivers and seas. Yoga was created 5,000 years ago and has roots in Hinduism, Buddhism, and Jainism. The world's cheapest car, the Tata Nano which mm. costs around 100,000 rupees, the equivalent of $1,400. And the first next generation of thorium reactor. The country is aiming to produce 30% of its electrical power with thorium by 2050. Number 11. You can stay at the former Indian royal residence for $88,000 a night. If you want to stay at the lap of luxury, forget Paris and forget Dubai. India is the home of the palaces throughout the country, the with some dating back hundreds of years. The Kumara Lake Resort hosted Prince Charles's 65th birthday, and the 450-year-old Samod Palace in Jaipur has hosted famous faces from all over the world. Number 12. King Jai Singh of Awa snubbed Rolls Royce in the best possible way. India has a long and colorful history of quirky monarchies and extravagant kings and queens. The king of Alwar in northeast India was insulted by a Rolls Royce salesman when he visited a showroom in London. A very proud man, he ordered a whole fleet of Rolls Royce cars and gave them to the city's waste department so they could use them to transport rubbish throughout the city. Number 13. One million Indians are millionaires. India has one of the most dramatic wealth gaps in the world, with 35% of the country living below the poverty line. Those who live way above it live a very different kind of life. The richest Indian in the world is Mukesh Ambani, who has a net worth of $53 billion. The 59-year-old made his money in the oil and gas industry, and his billion-dollar home recently made headlines because he chose to build a 27-story skyscraper instead of a sprawling mansion. Number 14. The first account of plastic surgery was found in an ancient Sanskrit text. One of the first medical texts was the Sushruta Samhita, which can be dated back to the 6th century CE. It's one of the very first examples of a medical text and discusses surgery, incisions, skin grafts, 
and nose reconstruction. Britain's first nose job wouldn't be performed until 1814, a worrying 80 years before the Sushruta Samhita would be translated. Number 15. One of India's most extravagant weddings caused controversy because it was too extravagant. Lasting five days and costing $74 million, the wedding of the daughter of a prominent businessman made headlines in 2016 for all the wrong reasons. A $2.5 million wedding sari, Bollywood royalty in attendance, and gold Bangalore palace setting was denounced as an obscene display of wealth. Millions of Indians live in poverty, so the wedding was criticized for being in poor taste. There are many stereotypical images of India, but there's so much more to this incredible country than many of us know. The center of many industries and the world's biggest democracy, India has influenced art, literature, science, and medicine potentially more than any other nation. If you could take a trip to this beautiful, fascinating country, where would you find yourself? In a gorgeous Maharaja's palace, surrounded by palm trees and rural countryside, or a modern apartment in the thick of busy Mumbai? Hmm. 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 तो उस बारे में हम जैसे सर्जरी वाला था सर्जरी के मुताबिक जो बताया गया है क्या वो जो माँ जो किंग थे जिनके बारे में बताया गया है को मेले का भी बताया था टाटा की गाड़ी का पता था ठीक है केश अंबारी की वो तो जरी बात है जो मिलियन है दस लाख मिलियन ये मुझे पहली बार पता है कि दस लाख मि� हाँ एक सौ तीस करोड़ में से भाई तो इस लिहाज से जो है ना काफी चीजों के चीजों के बारे में मालूम हासिल की पहले और काफी चीजों के बारे में जो है ना मैं इन्होंने कुछ बताया है ताजमहल के जैसे बताया गया था वो भी हमें पता था ठीक है लेकिन एक चीज यार वो आपने नोट किया इसके अंदर कि जो है ना जो कुंभ मेले के अंदर जो बताया गया था यानी कि वहां पे लोग जैसे आ रहे थे कई हमने बीच में ऐसे भी देखे जिन्होंने इनके ड्रेस नहीं पहने हुए थे ठीक है तो क्या उनका कोई इसमें यह होता है कि आपने मनत मांगी होती है मुझे लगता है ना शायद वो हम जानते नहीं आप हाँ, वो आप ज्यादा बेहतर तरीके से बता सकते हैं हमें ऐसा आखिर क्यों होता होगा ऐसा हाँ ऐसा क्या होता है इसमें क्योंकि मोस्टली तो सब ने पहने होते हैं लेकिन कुछ ने नहीं पहने हुए थे उनका वो मतलब है कि क्या एक मानना होता है किस चीज के लिए होते हैं तो ये आपने हमें जरूर बताना है कमेंट सेक्शन में और शायद मुझे यही लगता है लेकिन ये तो मजीद हाँ और और दूसरी जो है ना बाकी अच्छा तुझे ये पता है कि बेंगलोर है एक सिटी और एक मैंगलोर भी है मैंगलोर मैंगलोर भी है हाँ मैंगलोर वैसे टॉप हंड्रेड सिटीज में नहीं होगा क्योंकि हमें टॉप हंड्रेड सिटीज पे एक्चुअली वो मैंगलोर पे लिखा है लेकिन मैंगलोर है ठीक है और ये केरला में है मैंगलोर ठीक छोटा हो गया लेकिन ह मतलब मैंने कहा ये बेंगलोर और मैंगलोर में कोई फर्क है कहते हैं हाँ मैंगलोर अलग सिटी है बेंगलोर अलग सिटी है तो बस उस 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 वक्त मुझे पता लगा मैं कहा अच्छा वो भी बड़ी प्यारी सिटी है यार दिखाई है ना हाँ मैंने उन्होंने कुछ रेनी एक रेनी होगी तस्वीरें मुझे सेंड की थी मुझे बड़ा अच्छ और काफी इंटरेस्टिंग किस्म के फैक्ट्स थे जिनके बारे में जान के बड़े अच्छा लगा है तो बहरहाल आपको हमारा रिएक्शन कैसा लगा हम जरूर बताना है जाने से पहले आपसे कहेंगे हमारे चैनल को सब्सक्राइब करें लाइक करें कमेंट करें वाचिंग पाकिस्तान